welcome to the Ask the Global Girl series. And this is where you get to send your questions in about international business and international trades, and we get to answer them. So today's question um, is, now that I got the meeting with an international partner, what do I do next? Okay, so now that you have this meeting, I hope you've done your homework. That is super important. The first thing you wanna do is definitely do your homework understand this company, their core values, their mission, their vision, their strategic plan for the next five to 10 years, understand their global expansion plan if they have one, find out if they've ever been in an international country or not, understand what their next move is, what are they already planning, and then, that is so key, understand what are their key products that they have and what products are they looking to expand, or do they have any new products that they're actually bringing into the market? That's something that you want to look into. Then, you also want to look know your country. You know, and a lot of times, I mean, it's kind of almost sounds silly, like, know my country. But yeah, you also want to make sure that you know in your own country what are the gaps. What gaps are you looking to fill? And so that question is, when you're looking at this company and you're looking at your country or your company, where are the gaps that you're looking for them to come into your market and actually close up that gap for that? And so that calls you not to only know your country, but you also need to know also your company. You have to really understand your company, what your strengths are, and how you would be able to make this uh, relationship work. Which comes to the third thing, know what you want from them. It's not, uh, don't walk into a meeting and just say, hey, I would love to partner with you. Know clearly what areas you want to partner with them in and be able to spell that out for them very clearly. And so don't think that they're gonna guess by thinking, oh, I know that they, they have a need for this. No, you have to say to them, these are the areas that I see where we can partner. These are the areas I would love for us to work together or explore. And you can actually uh, work together in, with US companies in so many various ways. We have another video on that and talk about the different ways to build uh, strategic alliances internationally. But when you're at that table, be very concise, be very precise general information that we can find on the internet or they can Google you about, you probably want to skip over that or either put that in a document but don't spend that time reading. Understand that people's times are very short and attention spans are even shorter. So make this meeting and your first impression a great one. Have an amazing day. I'm Sable Badaki, The Global Girl.